In a previous video called How to Customize Your Equid Store in WordPress, we looked at how to design the store appearance and store page content. This page is found in your WordPress site by clicking on Equid and then clicking on Storefront. In this video, we're going to focus on the navigation section of this page, where I can now decide whether I'm going to put my store on my home page, and if not, create pages so people can find my store, such as adding the store to a menu and managing product in sidebars and other pages and posts. In a previous video, we said we wanted to show our store on our homepage, and so I clicked this link. Customizing your store page address may not be necessary. If your store is embedded on your homepage, well then, that's where your store is. If I turn that off, however, and I go to my site, well, of course, the store is no longer there. I have a menu item called Store, and that's now where my store is found. So if your store is not on your homepage and you'd want to change that to say shop or products, well then you'll edit the URL slug. If you're familiar with WordPress, you know that the term slug just refers to the text that's in the URL for that particular page. So I'm gonna click edit URL slug and here I can change store to shop and click save. Now when I head back over to my site, and I add the word shop to the URL, well, it takes me to my store. In addition, I can add the store page to a menu item. I can feature products in a sidebar. Now, I need to be using a theme that uses a sidebar, so I've switched my theme to 2016, and of course, here's my sidebar with my sample page. Heading back over, I'm gonna click Manage Sidebar, and I'm just gonna grab my latest products, click, drag, limit it to three, and now when I hit refresh, there's my three latest products from my Equid store right in the sidebar of my sample page. For instance, if you have a blog or any page on your website, it's really simple to embed Equid products anywhere in your WordPress site. If you're interested in creating separate pages for your cart, search pages, category page, product page, and adding your store to other site pages, you can do that here. Equid already provides a cart and checkout page for you. Adding a search page is simple. Just click create a search page and the search and filters block will be placed into the page for you. Then I can use the WordPress block system to put anything I want either above or below the search area. When I click publish, and view the page. I can now search for a scarf, and there it is. And you'll notice that the standard Equid links are embedded at the bottom of the page. If you're running a large site and the store is just part of your overall brand and you have pages, well, you can add your store elements to all kinds of different pages. For instance, I'm gonna click on the sample page and I'm gonna embed a product right here in the middle. Simple as this. I'm going to insert a new block after this one. Come down to Equid, and I can embed even my store homepage, a product search box, product search with filters, store and category page, or this product card, which is a larger version of the single product embed widget. And let's choose that men's scarf click update and preview and now even in the middle of my page there's my men's scarf product ready for someone to purchase finally after you create some of these pages you can choose which page should be the main store page right now I only have three of course so store search products or sample page but if I add other pages to my WordPress site I can define any of them as the main store page. You have complete flexibility over how Equid is embedded and interacts with your WordPress site.